some people have been requesting a collection video and I've been waiting to do that until I can have the USS flag out and assembled because that is part of my collection but I don't usually have it on display but I have it out for now and so I'm going to run through my collection this isn't actually everything uh, some things uh, incomplete figures are just in boxes I don't have them out also there are two vehicles that won't be present uh, I have the Cobra Night Raven and the G.I. Joe Conquest X-30 on display in my office, so I don't have them to show you right now, uh, but I do have them complete with the pilots. Uh, so, uh, and this, uh, I wasn't able to fit everything on the deck of the USS Flag, so I'm going to run through these, and then I'm going to take them all off and put another set of stuff on here, uh, and we'll just try to get through the whole collection that way. So let's start at this end. I've got a couple boxes here. I don't usually get boxes, but they're nice for display when I can get them. Uh, I've got a couple of uh, 82 and 83 items up here. Down here we have uh, some of the snow vehicles and troopers. Now these are not organized in any particular order. I do have have like the snow troopers down on this end but that's as close as this gets to organization we've got the cobra maggot there we've got um the uh, bridge layer, which doesn't have stickers, and it's been repaired. I really probably should get a new one. Uh, we've got the devilfish there. Uh, we've got, uh, that's part of the USS flag, those little little vehicles, tripwires there. I don't have his accessories on him, but I do have them. Uh, there's Duke in the, uh, in the uh, Skyhawk, uh, the APC, uh, the Cobra Wolf. Um, there's Grand Slam on the HAL, uh, some, some laser rifle troopers there, a Roadblock, a Spirit, a couple of Scarlets, Straight Arm and Swivel Arm, there's a Falcon, there are my five Steel Brigades, uh, a couple of Parachute Packs there, uh, and then uh, here we have the 1983 G.I. Joe Headquarters Command Center, and I've kind of stuffed some things in there, uh, the Vamp and the Ram Motorcycle, a few figures, you can see who's there. Um, a couple of stalkers. Uh, there is short fuse. Um, I do have his accessories, uh, not all variations, but I don't have them uh, with him right now. Um, there's the recon sled, uh, breaker in there. We've got two breakers, that one there, and then the one on the motorcycle over there. Uh, and there's ripcord. We got the Mobat tank with Steeler. Uh, we've got over here the uh, slugger. Uh, we've got a, a few more figures. There's Gung Ho and Doc. I do have Doc's accessories. Uh, we've got the Sky Striker, and I have um, the shark kind of riding piggyback there just to save space. And there is Deep Six with that crazy hose and pump that he came with. Uh, we've got uh, Airborne. We've got the Pack Rats. Uh, a few other figures. Um, there's the Dragonfly. Uh, there's uh, the first version of Hawk back there with the MMS. And finally down here, there's the Tomahawk. And uh, up here we've got uh, my only two carded action figures. Um, you know, I don't know even why I have those, but uh, you know, there they go. Uh, there is Lifeline there. Uh, standing on the USS flag. We've got the Viper pilot. Uh, uh, we've got General Hawk and um, Admiral Keelhaul, Shipwreck, Lady J, uh, Chabong. Uh, there's, that's a weird combo right there. There's the uh, um, second version of Grunt there with the Falcon glider and the Cobra Viper glider. Well, swinging around back here, there's the uh, Wolverine with Covergirl. There's my broken Zap figure. Uh, over here we've got the Vamp Mark II, the Awe Striker, uh, we've got Rakondo riding on there. And here, these figures are just incomplete, and usually mostly they live in plastic bags. I don't normally have them out, but I thought I'd drag them out just for these purposes. Uh, and that is the first set of stuff. Uh, and I'm going to take these down and put a whole new set of stuff here so we can see the next section of my collection. Finally, the second half of my collection, and a lot of these are incomplete, but some of them are complete. Uh, there's the Mauler uh, tank, incomplete, unfortunately. Uh, I've got our Sergeant Slaughters there, our Cobra Asp. Uh, some figures here, a couple of bats, one of which is complete. Uh, I've got our Zoranas. We've got uh, Dr. Mindbender with both cape variants. Uh, I've got uh, Zartan back there with Monkey Wrench. We've got our Serpentors back there. The Yellow Neck Serpentor is right there. Uh, and then we've got, uh, there's the Mickey Mouse Cobra Commander, uh, Thunder Machine, uh, some, some other figures here, my Snake Eyes, um, Rock and Roll, uh, Tiger Force Duke, 
Uh, some of these are complete, some of them are not. There's the stinger. Uh, the stun is back there with both of the flags intact. Uh, there's the moray hydrofoil. Uh, there are a couple of boxes, a couple more boxes. I don't have very many boxes because I don't really look for boxes. It's really not my thing. Uh, we've got, there's the transportable tactical battle platform. Uh, up here in front, we've got some more cobras. Uh, we've got some snow serpents, only one of which is complete. A couple of vipers, uh, my cobra officers, uh, an incomplete uh, crimson guardsman, incomplete techno viper. Got the his tanks uh, with some very important people on board. There's the Baroness, Major Blood, and Destro. They're all complete. Uh, and uh, we've got our little hydro sled there. Uh, back up here, we've got the Havoc. I've got that sitting on top of the tactical battle platform. Uh, then on top of that, we've got the armadillo tank. There's Zanzibar and the air skiff. Uh, we've got our Navy SEALs. There's wetsuit and torpedo. Uh, incomplete uh, Alpine. Uh, there's Leatherneck. Uh, there's the, uh, that's the Manta uh, sail. Uh, there's the Dreadnought cycle. Got some more Dreadnoughts over here. A couple uh, Cobra soldiers, straight arm and swivel arm. Uh, we've got a couple of Fang helicopters. Kind of got their blades crossed there. Uh, but uh, they're both flown by co different versions of Cobra Commander. Uh, we've got the white and the blue snake armor back there. We've got a couple uh, claw uh, powered gliders. The Cobra Rattler with Wild Weasel. There are the twins. Uh, there is the uh, water moccasin with the two variant copperheads. Uh, there's Storm Shadow, two versions of Storm Shadow, Scrap Iron, Firefly. And then over here we have uh, the Killer Whale with Cutter. And on top of that is version two of uh, Rock and Roll. And uh, that's about it. That is my entire collection. Well, more or less. There are a few just odds and ends that I just kind of have in boxes somewhere. Uh, I don't have them out. I don't typically have them on display. Some vehicle shells that ha are really far from being complete. Uh, some figures that don't have any accessories. Uh, and I don't really count those. I mean, they need to be a bit more complete before I'll even really count them as part of my collection. Uh, but that's it. One thing that you might notice is a lot of the stuff here that's complete you have already seen in video reviews so I'm really just uh, barely keeping ahead of my reviews I need to have uh, stuff coming in pretty constantly in order to keep up with weekly reviews and have enough complete items to review every week uh, so that's just part of my uh, collecting uh, progress uh, and there's a lot that's not here uh, if you've been collecting a long time uh, you'll see a lot that just is not here and I'm still pretty much a novice collector I've got a long way to go uh, but that's just a quick look at the collection I hope you enjoyed it uh, keep watching this channel for more full vintage GI Joe toy reviews I'll see you next time